we have to prove the Wien's law from the Planck's law. For this, we shall take the Planck's law first. That is u lambda d lambda equal to 8 by h c by lambda to the power 5 into 1 by e to the power h c by lambda k t minus 1 d lambda. From this we have to prove the Wien's law that is u lambda d lambda equal to 8 by k t by lambda to the power 4 x by e to the power x d lambda where the value of x is ch by lambda kt now we take the Planck's law first and we have to know that Wien's law is only valid for the low value of the wavelength I mean lambda so lambda is very very less than 1 for the Wien's law so lambda is very very less than 1 so lambda t is also less than very less than 1 then 1 by lambda t is very very greater than 1 and then ch by lambda t k very greater than 1 so obviously the exponential ch by lambda t k is very very greater than 1 so we can neglect the minus 1 here the now minus 1 here from the exponential part as it very very greater than 1 so we can rewrite the Planck's law as 8 by hc by lambda to the power 5 into 1 by e to the power ch by lambda kt lambda tk into d lambda Now we use the value of x that is x equal to ch by lambda kt x equal to ch by lambda kt so ch equal to x lambda kt and using the value of ch I mean hc we put this and lambda to 5 1 by e to the power x d lambda this is after simplification it would be like 8 by kt by lambda to the power 4 into x by e to the power x into d lambda and this is the so called Wien's law which we have derived from the Planck's law this is the Wien's law Thus we can derive Wien's law from Planck law by this process and it's very simple to derive the Wien's law from Planck's law.